Amid the serenity of Yellowstone National Park's majestic landscape and the beauty of Hawaii's glowing lava, two major geological phenomena are stirring the minds of scientists and locals alike. Yellowstone supervolcano is showing signs of unusual magma movement, while Kilauea, one of the world's most active volcanoes, has officially entered its 27th eruptive episode since the start of its perpetual eruptive phase. Both events highlight just how dynamic Earth's crust is and how big a challenge modern Earth science faces. Yellowstone is known as a supervolcano because of its potential for a global eruption. Recently, seismic data and GPS monitoring by the US Geological Survey USGS, have indicated significant movement in a magma chamber 820 kilometers below the surface. These changes indicate caldera inflation, where the ground is lifted several centimeters in a matter of months. For scientists, this is an important signal. While it doesn't necessarily mean an eruption is imminent, it does indicate an active and changing magmatic system. It reminds us that Yellowstone is not just a beautiful national park, but also a natural laboratory for one of the most complex volcanic systems in the world. But the movement has also raised concerns among the public, Residents in Wyoming and surrounding areas have reported an increase in small earthquakes and changes in hot springs. While scientists stress that there are no signs of an imminent eruption, concerns cannot be dismissed. Yellowstone is no ordinary volcano. It is a supervolcano a type of volcano that has the potential to erupt on a global scale. Its last eruption occurred about 640,000 years ago, and the next major eruption, though extremely rare, could impact global climate, agriculture, aviation and the lives of millions of people. Mike Poland, however, stressed that the 7.20 a.m. event does not mean an eruption is imminent. Rather, it is a sign that the Yellowstone system is still very active. It's like the heartbeat of something that's sleeping, but not dead, he said. Wyvo is now beefing up its monitoring by increasing the frequency of satellite data collection and deploying additional volcanic gas sensors. Scientists are also collaborating with international agencies to monitor for aftershocks. The 7.20 a.m. event is a reminder that Yellowstone, as beautiful as it is, is a powerful geological force. The science world is facing a challenge understanding the subtle signals from deep within the Earth and communicating them appropriately to the public. Yellowstone has not yet woken up, but its pulse is already audible. As Yellowstone moves underground, Kilauea continues to spew lava to the surface. The volcano on Hawaii's Big Island is now in its 27th eruptive episode that began a decade ago. Kilauea's recent eruptions have been marked by effusive lava gushing from a fissure in the Halama Umau crater, as well as the formation of a new lava lake that is slowly rising to the surface. The 27th eruption, on the 29th of June 2025, was one of the most striking in a series of eruptive episodes that began earlier this year. During this event, lava erupted to a height of about 1,110 feet, about 338 meters. But more concerning was the significant increase in toxic gas emissions and the widespread phenomenon of Pele's hair. Pele's hair was seen in much greater quantities than in previous eruptions. 
This is a thin filamentous volcanic glass that forms when lava erupts and is pulled into fine filaments by the wind. Pele's hair is very light, easily carried by the wind, and has now been reported in communities around Volcano Village and along the tourist route of Hawaii Volcanoes National Park. It has a golden sheen, but is extremely sharp and can cause irritation if it comes into contact with skin, eyes or respiratory tract. Kilauea offers a unique opportunity to observe volcanic activity in near real time, but for Hawaiians, it's a double-edged sword. Lava has destroyed dozens of homes in the past and now concerns are growing about the potential for new flows that could threaten nearby communities. Scientists at the Hawaiian Volcano Observatory HVO, are continuously monitoring changes in gas pressure, ground deformation and lava temperatures. They note that the volcanic system appears to be entering a long cycle of recurring activity. While not as dangerous as Yellowstone in terms of eruption scale, Kilauea's relentless eruption rhythm is a source of psychological and logistical stress for local communities. What's happening at Yellowstone and Kilauea is a stark reminder that Earth is a geologically active planet. While volcanology has made significant progress, uncertainty is still an inevitable part of predicting eruptions. One thing is for sure. Yellowstone and Kilauea are not just objects of study, but symbols of the power of the Earth that continues to beat beneath our feet.